software demo. The each user in the services manager has a username and password and a group assigned to it. And a group is assigned to that user. I'll be using the admin username and password to log in into the system. As you can see, the admin the admin is assigned the administrator group. There are two groups, administrator and user. So there are a number of modules in this services manager uh, main window. The invoices, receipts, credit notes, customer details, control panel and reports. The user begins by but the user begins by creating an invoice. The invoice has a number of uh, fields as you can see here. Uh, it has the date which is the which is always the current date, the invoice number, the apartment, the meter number, customer name. This side handles the water billing management and the right hand side deals with service charge management. The user can also navigate to different records. Uh, the last record, first record. The user begins by adding a new invoice. As you can see, automatically the apartment number appears. So let's select apartment A2. Automatically the meter number appears. Today's date, uh, the current date appears, the invoice number, the customer name. And if there is a previous reading, then even that will appear automatically. So the, the user does not have to look into files to get the previous uh, reading or calculate in, anything to, to get the previous reading. So for example, if the current reading is, let's say, 220 this is based this is the meter reading by the way um, there is also a notification to verify all data entered before saving and here uh, the user puts in the other charges miscellaneous charges so in this case there are there aren't any notice all the uh, it automatically calculates the total water charge based on what current reading the user inputs. In this case, the total water charge is 750 based on this water rate, water consumption, discount units. Then the total invoice amount is uh, displayed here. Once the user is done, saves the invoice, invoice saves successfully. Once the invoice is done and the customer pays his invoice am amount, the invoice has been, uh, once the customer pays the invoice amount, then a receipt is uh, issued. Uh, the receipt has the exact same information as the invoice as you can see uh, so here the water charge is 250 so let's 250 and then this total service charge is 6500 the payment method is cash now this receipt already exists so here uh, um, it cannot accept an already saved receipt thereby uh, avoiding receipt duplicates. 
So we go to the last uh, invoice, receipt, 1,417,000. Is it saved successfully? Now in all these, there are certain checks and measures. Uh, you cannot, for example, put a letter, any letters or non-numeric characters. Also, you, can, you can't save this if some of the information is missing, like for example, current reading. <coughs> or even uh, if the current reading is less than the previous reading, that is obviously cannot be acceptable reading so these are various uh, checks and uh, measures additionally you can search for certain invoices like if I wanted to search for uh, based on apartment number if I wanted to search for apartment A2 invoices you can do that and also certain invoices I can search invoice number 21 Oops, sorry uh, let's take number 22 yes you can print that invoice and you can even do bulk invoice printing if you want to print a number of invoices you can select the date and uh, then for example all the invoices can also be all invoices that have been uh, issued can also be viewed at a glance the customer details and control panel can easily be accessed right from the invoice window the once a receipt is done, receipt is done, and there is an error uh, that is that has been detected. Let's say an overcharge, then a credit note will be issued from the receipt window. Okay, so captures all this information, all the receipt information, and the amount to be adjusted will be entered here. Customer details, self explanatory, apartment type, whether it's owner or landlord or tenant, customer name, meter number, PO box, telephone, mobile, and email. You can even search by particular apartment or by customer name. The control panel deals with the payment method either is it uh, is it cash is it M-Pesa check real money bank deposit or any other means of payment it also shows the discount units the rate the service charge amount this service charge amount is for example used as a standard figure in make in uh, in invoices the user the user registration is also found here user name the password and the group that the user is assigned to the administrator has all privileges and 
any user in the administrative group has all privileges any user in the user group has limited privileges the user does not have access to settings the control panel and audit trail and login trails apart from that any other thing the user has access to then the reports which is the best thing about software is that you can get certain reports with the click of a button see for example all paid all invoices which are paid the invoice number invoice date customer name the total charges total paid amount all these things are displayed and the total total paid amount is also displayed here the unpaid total charge the, the customer name total paid amount and total balance the aging overdue 0 and 30 0 to 30 days 0 to 60 days 0 to 90 days you can even search by a particular apartment say a2 so you can see the total charges the total paid and total balance to date there is also an audit trail which shows the actions of a, of a user for example here receipt number 34 was saved uh, let's take another one here user 1 on 5th of saved an invoice invoice number 42 and what was changed 135 145 previous reading and current reading edits also are are logged in so for example here the changed amounts were 300 and 6500 for service charge which was edited also the logins are are logged in uh, the username login date login time and the action all these records can also be can also be printed out and emailed as well exported to pdf can be also be exported to excel or emailed that's uh, that's all uh, thank you for thank you for, for uh, watching